Good morning, YouTube. It is Thursday. I am two days out from my first competition, so happy peak week to me, and it's been a blast. I've been having so much fun. Um, I've been on high carb since Monday. Um, I'm very high carb, actually, again today. It's 170 carb, 50 fat, and 110 protein, um, so like lots of food, actually. Um, I've been having great energy. I've been busting out my workouts real good and um, um, I haven't been hungry and I've been super motivated so with that being said let's get into breakfast so um, I check in with my coach in the mornings now um, every morning for peak week so he's really good about getting back to me um, and was super happy with today's progress so um, we just kept the macros high so let's show you breakfast I have two turkey sausages breakfast sausages an FDL um, donut and two of the rice cakes FDL um, peanut butter frosting and some apple butter high carbs um, yes yeah, so I'm gonna eat this and then <clears throat> and then he has me doing a full body circuit um, nothing too heavy or anything, so I might just bust it out here because um, it's raining and I have cardio after. I'd rather do cardio here anyways than go to the gym, so just like saving some time. I have like tons of weights here and resistance bands. I have weights up to like 75, but he wants lighter weight anywho. Um, I don't lift 75 anything, I don't think. So, um, yeah, so I have the weights here, resistance bands, some other fun toys. So I can just do like a nice circuit here. And it's only a 30 minute circuit, he said. So 30 minutes that, 30 minutes cardio, and bada boom.
is complete I'm going to hit my cardio now just 30 minutes um, treadmill incline so um, hope you like that workout it was actually really good it felt good I just kind of kept like going 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 you know circuit style um, more endurance so that was kind of fun different for me so yeah I'm going to do that I'm going to turn on the TV and watch some Food Network because food satisfies me. <laughs> it's like therapeutic to watch my cravings being eaten by other people. Yeah, so um, probably like the best thing I ever ate. I um, love that. So yeah, going to go do that. Alright, so I'm going to eat one of these um, cake bars. Well, I only have one left. Um, it's a Tickle Belly. Tickle Belly, I got it at the grocery store. Um, and then I'll show you my lunch because I'm about to head out in the... It's not raining, it's just a cloudy day. Hopefully I miss the rain. Um, but it's a Tupperware lunch as usual. So let me show you that. Looks kind of gross, but it is two cups. Uh, 312 grams of spaghetti squash. 60 grams of canned spinach. Salt. Lots of salt. Um, chili powder. Queso sauce. An uncured hot dog. No nitrates added from Trader Joe's. The macros are pretty dang good. 60 ca 70 calories. 3 grams of fat. 1 carb. 9 proats. Um, and then it's a ounce and a half of chicken. And some salsa. And that's all that's in there, I think. So, that's my lunch. I'm going to walk dogs, and I'll talk to you later. Um, I guess, so I'm just doing, like, what I, this was really good yesterday, so, I mean, delicious. But I'm pretty much just replicating, like, what I ate yesterday as much as I can since it worked for me. So, um, same foods, and I'll continue to show you. So, yeah. FDL Frosty and I have Greek yogurt under everything. Greek yogurt mixed with sugar free, fat free, chocolate pudding mix, um, enlightened ice cream, one and a half servings, um, triple chocolate, and then cold brew, an FDL donut, frosted flakes, and there was whipped cream there. I just had some like extra fat and carb. So I did whipped cream, but I ate it. <laughs> so I'm going to eat this. And shower, because I'm a mess. And it's like 4 o'clock p.m. I'm not hungry, though. See? Not hungry. Dinner time, and I have toast, spinach, runny egg, and Swiss cheese. I forgot to tell you, I got my nails done for the show today. So, yeah. This is my dinner, and then I'll grab my last thing after. Frosty with a cocoa light rice cake. Um, it's like 9 grams of frosted flakes, and then these pumpkin cranberry crisps from Trader Joe's. Very good. Seasonal. Love my pumpkin. Oops. Good morning, tomorrow is show day. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, I woke up and I'm like, ah, tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. So um, I just checked in with my coach. Um, he has me on high, high carbs today. So 100 protein, 200 carbs, 40 fat. Um, so I thought I'd do something a little different with breakfast to increase my carbs. So let me show you what I got. So I made French toast with egg whites, um, just like egg whites and cinnamon and a little bit of sweetener in the batter and then I just dipped it in. Um, and then on top we have pumpkin and yogurt to mix together, pumpkin puree. 
sear up two of those turkey sausages and an FDL donut. So I'm going to eat this and then I have another 30 minute circuit and cardio. So yeah, going to go do that. finished my workout so my lifting cardio I mean circuit so it's cardio time on the treadmill 
Hi YouTube, it is a show day. Um, I definitely failed at filming like anything else yesterday, but pretty much um, I worked out. I had to like meal prep and eat and then leave, go get my tan, my first coat of tan, my polygraph, and then I just came back um, to the Airbnb. I had like, I took a nice walk and then um, I just kind of like relaxed and watched Netflix and um, ate. So it is show day. Um, I'll show you my breakfast. I'm not sure how much I'll be able to film today. I'm not sure. I'm at an Airbnb so I'm trying to be quiet because um, it is kind of early. So let me show you what I have for breakfast. I just, um, it's pretty much what I usually eat. It's what my coach said to do. I'm eating on bed. How fun is this? Um, so I just have my two turkey sausages, flexible dieting lifestyles, donut, um, his cookie butter, and I put some sea salt in there because chocolate and sea salt is bomb, but, um, I'll probably add some more. And then some nuts and more birthday cake. I'm going to do two of the cocoa lights, so I'm going to eat, probably hit a walk, and then just head over to the, um, the show location, so, um, yeah, I'm excited. I'm a little nervous, but I slept really well, so I'm feeling good. I'm feeling super lean, too. anything after my breakfast um, but the show is over I'm my way on my way home and oh my wow to keep left my mom is cursing everybody nah this dude totally just cut us off what a what a what a jerk um, anywho back to me I placed um, fourth in bikini novice and fifth and open so I got two trophies um, feeling pretty good I feel like I'm not digging this look I gotta go home and shower I gotta get this stuff off me not a makeup person um, not a fake tan person so gotta get this all off me and I think the lighting also kind of sucks I look like weird but um just wanted to update you guys on that and I do get a cheat meal tonight so um, Maybe I'll show you. We will see. My mom's whispering because I told her not to talk. I think she's just saying how much I talk. I talk a lot. Alright, hi guys. So I might be like the worst YouTuber ever. Um, it is two weeks later and it is actually the day after my second show. So I just want to update you guys on what happened um, after my show with my cheat meal and everything. So I went to a Mexican restaurant and just got... Well, we got... um appetizers so we went with queso and guac and of course I had chips with those and then I got fajitas which is a pretty healthy option um, I got the chicken steak and shrimp combination fajitas I had four tortillas and ate all the meat all the guac all the cheese um, I don't like sour cream so I didn't eat that all the salsa I had a good amount of the rice, um, kept a lot of the beans, their beans aren't delicious. Um, but yeah, so I did that. Then we went to haagen got ice cream, a big sundae, well it wasn't that big, it was like a medium sized sundae, two scoops, um, toppings. I got through like half, felt super sick on the walk home to the car. I couldn't do it, I threw up a little bit. Um, so just goes to show you my tummy wasn't ready for it, but I felt better after, so um, my body my body knew what to do. Um, anywho, I did not film anything from the second show. If you follow me on Instagram, I did do some posts and some stories about show day. Um, more people came, so I just wanted to kind of like be around my friends and my family, and I mean, I still hadn't put this video up yet, so... I, I didn't want to give myself more work to do. Um, but yeah, that show was really fun. I placed fifth and open there. So I took uh, trophies from each show. I've been going back and forth about do I want to compete again. And honestly, the shows were really fun. 
Um, peak week number one fired me up. I loved it. Peak week number two, that's why I kind of didn't film. I wasn't so into it. Like, it was, it was still good. It was more like, I just want to get to the end and eat. Like, I was just, like, craving everything. And then, of course, last night I was, like, looking up shows and, like, thinking about doing one next weekend. Um, it's far away, though. Well, it's not that far. It's in um, Pittsburgh. So, I mean, it's, like, a three-and-a-half, four-hour drive. Um, so I'm not going to do it. I just want to eat, start making my gains. My dad wouldn't come with me if he came. Um, I might have considered doing it. But, uh, anywho. So, yeah. So I'm done for the season. I might, um, I might compete again. I'm not sure. I, I liked it. I went back and forth about it. Um, I didn't like losing my strength, my energy. I think it's really hard since I'm a dog walker. Um, I need to work out do my cardio, and then I still have to walk for like four hours every day. Um, so I think if I'm not a dog walker, it'll make life a little easier on me, energy-wise. Um, and I was just like pissed off at the world. Like I was not happy with a lot of people, and I just tried to not be around them. Anywho, so that's my prep story. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this video. And I hope that you enjoyed my prep series. I am going to come out with probably a few more videos about um, some, like, stuff with prep, even though it's post-prep. But, uh, yeah, and then maybe you'll see another prep series from me again. I might take the next season off um, and just grow and gain and travel a little bit. But, because I definitely don't want to be on prep when I'm traveling. I'm a, I'm a girl that wants to travel for her food. I'm a foodie, so... Um, yes, yeah, so I hope that you enjoyed this. If you like the prep series, like this video, then give it a thumbs up, comment below, um, and if I compete again, I'll ask y'all for some, um, recommendations, and if you have any videos you'd like me to put up now that I'm done with prep, let me know. Alright, thank you for watching.